Hey yo, what's up everybody and welcome back to another awesome video and yeah guys today we have a special video today I'm gonna be making a video why Mr. Beast didn't go on this Ocean Gate uh, Titanic submarine and yeah guys before this video starts you gotta smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn your post notifications to be a notification squad because you wanna stay tuned when this awesome videos come out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here's the tweet from Mr. Beast. Uh, he said, I was invited earlier this month to ride the Titanic submarine. I said no. Uh, kind of scary that I could have been on it. And then he posted an image with it. Also, I'm going to the Titanic in a submarine late this month. The team would be stoked to have you along. And he didn't. I, he kind of cropped it there, but uh, for some reason Mr. Beast declined and today I'm gonna explain why he declined and the truth behind it. So this the ex explanation and basically a small short video of this Titanic submarine and the CEO of this company. It was steered by a PlayStation controller. It was controlled by a PlayStation controller. bought from Camping World and there were questions about its safety rating. If you buy your components for a Titanic submarine that's going to get submerged to you need to buy something more reliable than a uh, cheap components and a PlayStation controller. Come on. Should he? Ocean Gate shouldn't have been doing what it was doing. And this is really focused on one thing and that's the pressure vessel. 4,500 feet in the Titan submarine. On making sure that 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 component which is clearly the most critical component of the sub. Uh... Yeah he was actually there was a there was a company employee who was working at Ocean Gate and he was saying that is it, it is not safe for people to submerge. Some of the footages uh, of the Ocean Gate submarine how it looks like and it's being submerged uh, right there and it doesn't it doesn't look like it's the most safest thing. So here's some of the footage of the Ocean Gate submarine right there. The footage shows submarine used by the company and this is how it's supposed to be like viewing the Titanic right there but everything could have possibly gone wrong gone wrong and this is some of the footage before the submarine was submerged the vessel. submarine the yeah, vessel has one button with this game controller with uh, a gaming a, controller yeah, oh my god Logitech of course mr beast is gonna say no if the whole thing is controlled by a playstation controller all right ladies and gentlemen also i wanted to add uh they actually signed a contract and it said three times that they possibly can end up uh in the situation like it ended up basically they could possibly die and they had to sign the uh, consent form that in any situation they're not going to be a response the ocean gate is not going to be responsible for their death and they had to sign it three times which is crazy usually like if you go skydiving you sign it once like it's a possibility of death and blah 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 and you had to sign it three times this time so which is kind of concerning and i guess they just kind of skipped this uh step like without even giving it some thought about it uh, i don't know they just you know just went with it all right ladies and gentlemen so here's the truth why uh, mr beast didn't go on this uh titanic submersible uh submarine vessel type uh with whatever you call it it's made out of cheap material uh, it looks like a minivan it can only fit like five people and they're kind of crowded there there's a restroom but uh, instead of uh, caring about the restroom, you should have uh, been concerned about the whole construction and the implosion that actually happened prior of this submarine vessel getting uh, like lost on the any radar, basically. Uh, the experts saying that the implosion happened way before that, before they uh, disappeared from the radars and the tragedy that happened. So it makes sense if the whole thing is getting controlled by a PlayStation controller from, I don't know, Walmart or Best Buy. It's a $30 controller and the whole thing is, is like a video game. And it's crazy to me how uh, such a rich people pay 250000 to go on this submersible and they don't realize the safety concerns of this whole vessel. It doesn't look, it doesn't look um, very trusting, that type of like, you know, the quality. It doesn't look safe to submerge yourself in such deep waters. The materials are cheap. Uh, the price is expensive for the thing you're paying, which is, I thought you're gonna get yourself submerged in some huge uh, submarine that actually goes there to see the Titanic, but that's it. Um, if there's a small window, nothing much you can see, you can type in anything on YouTube and see the Titanic, like leftovers from the previous videos, from previous submerges, and basically that's the whole thing. I don't know why would you uh, submerge yourself into such a deep waters where it's really dangerous uh something like this could have happened to you and it happened because of the lack of safety and safety concerns but uh yeah 
that's the whole thing and yeah guys hopefully you enjoyed this video make sure to smash the like button subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications to be a notification squad because you want to stay tuned when this awesome videos come out and yeah guys i'll see you next time peace <laughs>